Astronomers have found something in space that moves on its own, and it's many times the size of our planet Jupiter. Astronomers spotted a mysterious, highly metallic and isolated object in the depths of space. It's way bigger than Jupiter. It moves on its own, and scientists still cannot explain its nature. And this is an image by uh, artist rendering of ESO, European Space Organization. Astronomers spotted it, highly metallic, isolated, moving on its own. According to FIS.org, it was first identified in 2012 by Philippe Delorme and his team at Grenoble Alps University in France. Scientists still cannot agree on the nature of this mysterious object, which they called CFBDSIR 21490403 for short. Its full official name is that. Okay, it's a, another number. They hypothesize that the object is, is, is a young, isolated object of planetary mass or a small, low mass, high metallicity dwarf. They estimate that they may have a mass ranging from about 2 to 40 times the mass of Jupiter. I mean, 2 is still big, but 40 times is huge. But it's difficult to agree with any certainty, since before that, a planet is about 100 light years away. The results of the new observations are published in Cornell University Library article ARXIV dated uh, February 3, 2017, and could potentially help distinguish between these two affirmation categories. Of course, there's also theories that estimate that it is an autonomous planet that moves and is directed according to the will of those who rule it and its inhabitants. Others claim that it's the so-called planet Nibiru, planet X. However, this estimate cannot even be included in the unrealistic and or outrageous theories due to its enormous distance from our solar system. However, things may be about its true nature. One thing is a fact that it exists and it is moving on its own, a fact that no one can dispute. This I've translated for you from a Greek article. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.